protest today about climate change, organisers of the Youth Strike for Climate campaign say the demonstrations are being held in 60 British towns and cities against what they see as government inaction on global warming. Downing Street says the strikes are disruptive and increase the workload on teachers. Our reporter Afa Ahmed has joined protesters outside the Houses of Parliament in London this morning. Afa, what's going on? Well, as you can see, hundreds of pupils have taken the day of school on this sunny Friday afternoon to protest about climate change. And these scenes are being mirrored, as you said, across more than 60 towns and cities in the UK. Pupils wanting to raise awareness about climate change. And I'm joined by one of them now, 18-year-old Sophia from Aylesbury. Sophia, tell me, why are you here today and why have you skipped school? I think there's a complete ignorance about what climate change is really going to do to us. The Met Office predicts that 130 million people extra per year will be displaced due to sea level rise by the year 2050. And if we think any refugee crisis we have now is bad, imagine a global displacement of coastal communities. And we are just ignorant and we, we don't care about this, um, this happening in our country. And the government is ignoring climate change simply because it won't win over voters. It's not an immediate um, response, immediate benefit. And the roads now have been closed off because there are so many pupils. What do you think your teachers make about you skipping school today? I think they'd be pretty, pretty proud. I'm missing geography today and I think she'd be really proud that I'm here and protesting for the environment. And do you think you'll come back out on the streets again? I'd love to, yeah. If, as long as there's another protest for a cause that I believe in, especially climate change, I'm here. The protest is expected to continue for much of the day. There are signs here saying homework is worse than climate change and the pupils I've spoken to say they will be continuing to carry out these strikes for as long as they deem necessary. The UK Student Climate Network say they want the government to declare a climate emergency and fully include young people in decision making, especially when it comes to issues around climate change. Arthur, thanks so much.